Hi folks, I'm Queerist, and today we're going to be playing The Sims 4. Today we're spotlighting what's one of the most versatile items in the game, the mighty dumpster, in all its stinky, cockroach-infested glory. Dumpsters in The Sims 4 are loot boxes, but with extra tetanus. Dig around and you can find almost any item in the game. Sure, the items are broken, on fire, and covered in a thin veneer of filth, but that makes them better for reasons I refuse to explain. So, the glamorous trash can family will be starting a challenge today. Step one, spend six days spelunking in garbage. Step two, sell what items they can to buy a retail lot. Step three, question mark, question mark, question mark. Step four, build a department store of trash of unparalleled quality and success. Now, they're not allowed to buy any furniture, so unless something's already on a lot, they better hope they get lucky. Not here, though. This gorgeous, artisanally crafted junkyard is public property, where I, as in all things, am God. Introductions. This is Brooklyn. Brooklyn loves vermouth and hates people. Sunny only looks like a hippie who owns a legal weed dispensary. He's like... 25. Brienne should be in medical school right now, but here she is talking to a cat's butt. And then Tessa. I wasn't planning to include Tessa. She's one of my existing sims, but well, I love her. And of course, there's a cat. Behold, Miss Kitty. She is my queen. So let's get started. I know they're afraid of the weather, but I like to imagine it's an anticipation of the smell. Huh. Let's move this to the front, shall we? So, I set this challenge in the summer, thinking that would give them the best chance at great weather. I wanted natural disaster, and that's what I got. And yeah, I went into this challenge knowing I was going to have to click the Dive for Deals button around 9,000 times. Look upon my accomplishments and despair. Ugh, the man is just so scared. Too bad, so sad, Sonny. Get in the metal box already. Around here, we like our salespeople extra crispy. The multiverse is a concept about which we know frighteningly little. And yeah, look, the last time I did this, I was using a dump site that was entirely indoors, so I'm sure there are going to be no repercussions for my decisions here. See? She's fine. And away she goes. Is she running inside where it's safe? No, she's going to the bathroom. That is the bathroom. You know, I'm not even gonna comment on how the dust plumes off her butt. Another lightning strike, another thousand yard dash, and... Uh, oh, oh, wait, okay, hold on. Uh, I didn't actually know this was possible. Oh, yes, uh, let's, uh, let's get you inside, okay? Yeah. Honestly, I've never met a guy who more earned that thousand-yard stare. Not gonna lie, I find their intense social awkwardness really relatable. Okay, just need to get Brooklyn some entertainment and... Wait, no, no, Tessa, no, you can just do that in the... And she was just in the bathroom, too! Brienne, you speak for all of us. And it's official. Sonny is cursed. He has angered some eldritch horror, some olden god. There's no other explanation. Somebody, somewhere, wants this man dead, and I'm not sure I want to know why. Tessa, at least, has no conception of the danger she's in, and I love her for it. So... Brienne decided to use her laptop outside, in the rain. Yeah, it broke. 
Anyway, I uh, built this set with the assumption it was just going to be the trash can family doing this. So, Tessa doesn't have a bed. Let's do something about that. Did the tent get hit by lightning within five minutes? Yes. Yes, it did. Is that lady judging my cat? To have any chance of selling this stuff, they're going to have to learn to repair things. Thankfully, so far we've learned electricity. Totally safe. Stompy lady, I want you to know, you complete me. Did you know that showers are best conducted in an elaborate flurry of dressing and undressing for no damn reason? Oh, and what's this? My notification wall is full? I've been clicking the same action for hours now. Tell me more. And, uh, yeah. In case you're new to The Sims 4, I want to correct you. That's not a bicycle. It's an immovable pathing obstruction. She will starve to death here. Honestly, eating your dinner in the pouring rain behind a chain link fence is kind of a mood. What did I say? They are cursed. She's inside the doorway, but what? Ah, oh, I love the total ambivalence of everyone around her. And yes, if I could make out with my boyfriend in front of Santa Claus, I'd probably do it too. I just love this woman's expression of pure hatred. That is a side eye for the ages. Okay, Brooklyn, back to work. Fists clenched, Sunny watches the Penguin television set. But Tessa has other ideas. In case you're wondering, Tessa sensed with her third eye the presence of a mouse and decided to be naked to check it out. And, uh, you're not gonna believe me when I say this, but I genuinely thought when I told her to check the garbage bins, she'd put on some clothes first. I just assumed. It didn't occur to me that she would just... And again! I didn't tell her to do that! I tried to get her to go inside and have a shower! Why are you riding a bike naked? I'm really starting to question her judgment. I just love the way Miss Kitty doesn't give a single solitary crap about that mouse. Brooklyn's disinterested stare is brought to you by the fact this is the last day of the challenge. Vendor time. Except the vendor table is super glitchy in this game. Like, Tessa was here trying to sell merch and this other lady put her own items on the table and started selling hers as well? Also, Miss Kitty likes exactly two things. Running at strangers and eating garbage. Can somebody tell me what Santa Claus is doing in this clip? Anyway, it was so broken, I had to move them off-site. The floating vase of flowers assures us everything is working as intended. Brooklyn knows the secret to any garage sale is maniacal laughter. So, the goods are there, waiting to sell. Once they're gone, they'll be able to move on to their retail lot and really go up in the world. Or down. Down is possible, too. Thanks everybody so much for watching. This is usually the part where people say to like and subscribe, but uh, this is my first YouTube video, so it's a miracle you're even here. Have a great day.